Having this core group together, I mean, the kids that started three seasons ago as, as you all move ahead and assuming Mitch is a part of that, uh, what does that mean as, as you get ready to graduate to that next year and, and perhaps uh, move it up a step further? Yeah, it's good. I mean, it's, uh, I mean that's a goal. You want to move together as a group. And uh, I mean, when you have a core like that, that, you know, kind of gets going at the same time, it's enjoyable to watch them, um, you know, get better and grow and be a part of it. And, you know, that's certainly what's happened here. How concerned are you that we're here on the eve of camp and Mitch is still unsigned? You know, that's not our main concern as players. we got to be ready for camp. You know, we're going out east tomorrow. Um, we've got things to worry about. We had a skate this morning. We're just trying to get better and, you know, make sure that, um, you know, we're ready. And, um, you know, we let the other group take care of that. And, um, you know, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. Last year was Willie, really this year Mitch, and this is a mark that there's always seems to be something mm -hmm. kind of stirring. It, you just get used to kind of dealing with these type of things and focusing on what you have to. Yeah, you just deal with it as it comes. Uh, I mean, like I said, that's not within our control as players. I mean, we talk to Mitch, and obviously we want him here. He's a you know, big part of our group, and he's a great teammate. And, you know, we want him in the mix. But, um, I mean, there's only, you know, it's really only so much you can do as a player. I mean, you got to get ready. Um, you know, you got to worry about your own game. Uh, I mean, like I said, camp starts tomorrow. So, you know, we got our hands full there. And, uh, I mean, we'll let the the other people take care of what's you know going on with Mitch. What are you ex what are you hoping for? What are you excited for for Newfoundland? What do you think is going to happen there? Um, I'm just excited to get going. I think uh, I mean this past week has been you know just a lot of uh, informal skates and workouts, and once camp gets going, it's a lot more fun. It gets a bit more intense. You get to kind of get a feel for you know line mates, partners, um, practices and stuff, and you know it's just more fun once it gets going. Three or four years along with Mike Babcock, how do you think he's come along with the, with the younger guys? Has there been a relationship build up there? Yeah, I think so. I mean, I think that's important. You know, there's obvi obviously been a lot of turnover in terms of the, the the players he's worked with, and I think when you look at his body of work with the young guys, I think it's been great. Um, as a coach, it can be tough, I'm sure, to manage different personalities. I think he's done a, a good job. But, I mean, that being said, we've got a ways to go to, you know, achieve the ultimate goal. And uh, there are players that want to get better, and he wants them to get better as well. So, you know, that's really all I can ask for. But, I mean, like I said, we're looking forward to getting going. And once camp starts for real, that's when, uh, you know, it becomes fun again. What do you think of the, the uh, improvements in the division, just with Florida yeah. coming on? And even Buffalo yeah. And yeah, I think you can't help but notice, you know, within the – Division, um, there's been a lot of improvements. Teams have gotten better, but I think if you look around the league, that's just that's what happens. Um, you know, it's very competitive. Guys want to win. Teams want to win now. Um, so you just deal with it. You just kind of prepare. You, you just want to be ready for camp, and you hope your teammates are doing the same thing. And I think, you know, with this team, um, you know, we've got a motivated bunch, and I think that's, that's you know, not an issue for us. What do you think of... Um, have you had to uh, work with... Uh, Tyson Berry and Cody Cece yeah. and informal skates. What have you made of what you've seen from those guys? Yeah, it's been good. But, I mean, like I said, he, I mean, you got to wait till camp till it really gets going, um, start playing for real. But, you know, I've known Tyson and I've known Cece for a while. So, I mean, they're both great players. And, you know, we're very lucky to have them. And I think they make our, our back end better. And, in turn, I think our team's in a better position. What about you guys? You had to wave goodbye to a lot of, a lot of good friends, yeah. Morgan. Yeah, yeah, there's been a lot of change for sure. Uh, it's been strange that way. You know, guys that were here for a long time, too, with Jake and Nas, obviously, and, you know, many others, but, um, you know, it is what it is. It's, it's, it's part of the business. I know it's a cliche, but, you know, it happens every year. There's there's guys you know, there's close friends that leave, and it's unfortunate, but, I mean, you're happy for them. they got a new start, and hopefully they can make the most of it. How do you think of meeting with Adam Sandler come about? <laughs> I don't know. Um, it was pretty fun, though. Uh, we just played basketball with him and kind of talked to him about Tiff, and, yeah, you know, we had a fun day with him. Better mustache, him or Austin? Uh, him. What do you think of Austin's stash? I like it. It's got it's got some growth left. Though. How long have you been able to dunk for? Uh, not that long. One more, guys. For you, uh, what, what role did DJ Smith play in your development, and are you at all surprised that he landed a head coaching gig? Not at all. Um, you know, DJ is a great coach and has a great personality, and um, he's really motivated. And I think that's kind of where we really got along. We could laugh and um, you know be quite candid with one another. But at the end of the day, he, he he's a winner and you know wants to win. So I'm not at all surprised that he's a he landed a head job, and you know, good for him. But you know, that being said, we got to deal with him now. You know, within our division, and I think we're looking forward to that. And I'm sure he is as well. So, um, I, you know, I think he's going to do a great job. And I think the players that know him really speak highly of him. And um, so, I mean, like I said, I'm not surprised.